Okay, here we go. Your Latin. Try is what? Oui. Mm -hmm. Ob. Against. Mm -hmm. Per. Um, perforate. To plug us? No, if you perforate your paper, it goes all the way down. No, it goes all the way through. Oh. Okay, how about trans, transatlantic? To go across. Uh-huh. Post is? Before. No, after. Right. By means? To. Okay. Odd. To listen. Mm-hmm. Dis is to. Um. Dis, dislike. Uh, I think not. Yeah, and dis, dismiss. When everybody gets dismissed, they go what? Away. Well, not away, but apart. Oh. Okay, how about add, advance? Told. Mm hmm Super? Super. Um, above. Mm hmm Poor information. Two, two sheep. Mm hmm Pro is? Uh, progress. Yeah, if you progress, you go? Forward. Yeah. Inter, international? Uh, between. Uh-huh. What does that say? Able. Mm hmm Which means? Able. Able to, to, except for we don't say like wash able. You and I say what? Wash able. I able, probably. Yeah. Gress. Um, progress to go forward. Or to step. Yep. Rock de rock to break. Uh huh. This says shun. Uh huh. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Duct conduct. Um. Like if they conduct to lead. Yeah. Contra is to go. Forward. No, if you if I contradict what you just said, I went backward. No, I went against it. Oh, so I yeah. contradicted like, you. Uh, yeah, we just did that one two times ago. Okay, how about con connect? Together. Uh-huh. Re is to do it. Again. In is two. Not an in. Yeah, in is probably first though. Yeah. D descend. Uh down. Uh-huh. Pre is to do it. Before. Mm -hmm. X. Oh, these uh, are old ones. Out. Yeah. Sub is? Under. Uh-huh. Stru structure. To build. Mm -hmm. Flex is to? To bend. Fur. Transfer. To send? Yeah, or to bring, really. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Dick dictate. To say. Mm -hmm. Port portable. To carry. Check deject. To... Oh, swell. Yeah. Fact factory. To build? No. To make. Yeah, you make things in a factory. Good. Pet or pot is your feet. Uh-huh. That says? Shun. Able. Yeah, nice. And or uh -huh. spect is to see. Uh-huh. Pend. Um, pend. Pen, pendant. A pendant is a thing that what? A cross. It, well, what does a cross do? If you wear a cross right here, it... It means, I don't know. It hangs down. Oh. Okay, cred, credit. To believe. Mm -hmm. That says? Us. Uh -huh. That says? Shun. Yeah. Itty. Uh. No, well, e. E. Uh. E. e uh. uh. Good. Echo. Mm-hmm. Echo. Us. Yep. Eight. Yeah. Five. Vid. To to see. Mm hmm Track. To pull. To write. Mm hmm If there's an R. L there. If there's an L there, though, instead of R, it says... O. Yeah. Ish. Mm-hmm. If. Yep. Meant. Okay, so let's just go back to... Oh, that's not bad. Out of that whole deck, there's only three. So per... Remember, if the paper right here is perforated, it goes all the way what? Across. Not across, but down. Through. through. It goes through. See how this is perforated and yeah. you can just rip them? Contra. If you contradicted what I just said, you went um contra, contradict, contra flow. Remember the salmon swim contra flow. They're going Oh, sideways. Nope, they're not going sideways. They're going the river's going this way and they're coming this way. They're going across. They're going against. Oh. Remember? I contradict. Yeah. Remember, this is just like ob to go against. And pen pendant. A pendant is a thing that that no, hold. Not holds. Hangs. It hangs. Good. Pen pendant to hang. All right. All right. So let's leave these guys up here and let's what are you doing today? Green, orange, or black? Dev red. Um, I think I 
do? Because I think I just got a brand new pack. Well, not red. How about that? Okay. Closest thing I got to red. Okay, here we go. Alphabet script. out loud. Yes, script, please. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, oh, wait, mm -hmm. Q, N, O, P, mm -hmm. P, Q, then all mm -hmm. s t v oh, for wait s t u u is right k i think u up stroke up stroke up like that um, except for it just has to start on the bottom line. Oh, okay. Because otherwise it looks kind of like a yeah. weird V. Okay, Q R S T U V. Mm -hmm. This one goes like that. Correct. Then W. Mm -hmm. X. Y. And then Z. You got it. Okay, so let's do the four prefixes here. Hard ones. Let's start with which one means all the way through? Pen. Pen. Not pen. This is a prefix. If if you fold the paper and then oh, we cut it, this. yeah, you have to. Oh, um. It does start with a P. Not pre. Not pre. You're close. It's pull. Purr is right. P. Go ahead. So P, P E O. Okay, how about you know two that mean against? Um. Uh huh. That's the one you've known for a while. And then pen. No, you're stuck on pen. Pen is the root. <laughs> this is Sorry. to go against. Like if against you, if you the, the salmon, salmon. Yeah. What do they do? They swim against stream. stream. They go. Stream. What kind of flow? Uh, contra. Yeah. Good job. Contra. As in contradict. Good. And then let's do the prefix that means three. Oh, this one's easy. Yeah, this Try. Is an easy one. yeah. Okay. All right. Let's move on to roots. The root that means to hang. To hang. Pen. Yes. Finally got rid of that one. Okay. How about um, to build? To build a uh, fact? That's to make. That's close. You oh, build what? A, uh, it starts with the S. It does. You build a... Struct? Struct. A structure. Good. So struct. Struct. Nice. And how about to speak or to say? To say dick. Mm -hmm. And to make. You make things in a uh, fact. Yeah, factory is right. Nice. Okay. So, oh, you don't have to actually write factory. You could have just, just written fact. To. Okay. All right. Four suffixes. How would you spell ends ooh that one's easy uh, how do you spell it e n c e okay how about er when there's an l before it a l uh huh okay how about er when it's a person e, e no yeah e l e r is for for english oh, right? yeah this is for latin o r and then how would you spell shun for people shun for people C-I-A-N. Nice. 
All right. We're going to play tic-tac-toe. We are going to play tic-tac-toe in a few minutes. Okay, so let's do your review here. So I can put this down. You can put that down, yep. All right, okay. so here we go. What do we got? Adventure. Mm hmm Political. Uh-huh, political. Biceps. Which means you have how many? Two. Yeah, biceps. good. Reduction. Which means you said it? Before. Mm-hmm. Structural. It's something that you? Build. Yeah, the act of building. Exhaust. Distracted. Credit. Is a person who? Believes. Yeah, they believe you're going to pay them back. Good. Scriptural. Mm-hmm. Audience. Portable. Mountainous. Pentathlon. Pentathlon. Pentathlon, yeah, which means how many events? Five. Yeah. Podiatrist. Pod Podiatrist. Podiatrist, yeah. And what's this last one? Reflexive. Yeah, okay, all right. We're going to actually play tic-tac-toe with your Latin words. So hopefully you will have enough room. Um, all right, so here we go. Let's try. The first one is re Reflection. Okay. So what's the word? Reflection. Mm -hmm. R-E-F-L-E-C-T-I-O-N. Reflection. Beautiful. How about manufacture? You might want to write it in that box so you have room. What's the word? Man, you factual. Uh huh. Man, you factual. Sure. Yep. Manufacture. All right. Man, you factual. Perfect. Deformed. What's the word? Deformed. D E F O. Oh, um. uh, and now make it deformed, though. Make e -D. It in, yeah, in the past. Okay, how about rejection? Rejection? Mm -hmm. Rejection, yep. Sure. O E J E C T I O N? Rejection is right, nice. Attract. So what's the word? Attract. Uh, yeah, do you remember how to spell a? Uh, like alone, a. Uh, yeah, a. Okay. So a. T. T. Nice. A. Uh, a. C. T. Beautiful. Two T's because it's. A uh, vowel? Yeah, well, because it starts with an A. Usually uh. you double that letter. You're right. Good. Okay, how about protect? Protect. Well, tech. Protect is right. Okay. All right. Here comes your contra. Yeah. Contradict. Contradict. Uh huh. Contra. Contradict. Nice. Contra means to go. Oh, I know. I know. What is it? Contra means to go. If a salmon goes contra flow, oh. it goes. Uh, against. Against is right. Okay. How about information? Information. Uh huh. And. Information. Absolutely. Information. And the last one is scriptures. Scriptures. School. It. Scriptures. Script. 
Pictures is correct. All right, are you blue? Yes. Okay. Please. All right, let's do this. Hmm, I have to get my game on against you. Because I hate how you always beat me. <laughs> okay. All right, what do we got? Okay. Hmm. I'm thinking. I know, that's the problem. <laughs> That probably means I'm going to lose. No. Hmm. I think this is a good one. Attract. Um, my dad attracts people for work. True, for his business. Good. Oh, no. <laughs> I lost already. Contradict. <laughs> that sign... Looks like it contradicts what it's saying. S scriptures. In ancient Egypt, they had scriptures. Oh, good one. Reflection. I can mm. see my reflection in that glass. Rejection. Some people get rejection in baseball. Ooh, okay. Protect. Um... A lot of people have a dog to protect their homes. Yes, they do. Yeah, little noisemakers, too. <laughs> you really? Well, some dogs that just like... Oh, my yip, dog yip, is yip. in my, my house. Yeah, in your house, yeah. Deformed. The board deformed in science. Mm, I'm guessing nobody's winning, are they? Nope. Manufacture. Nobody uh, they manufacture cars in different parts of the world. In football, they sometimes have information. People is not in formation, right? Oh, this is information like questions. Uh, like, you had to look up information for your report. Oh, yeah. But I get what you're saying. You're saying in formation. Those are two separate words, though. Oh. Yeah, nice. Yay, I didn't lose to you. I'm fine with a cat's game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's your sentence. Um, your jugular, that's this big vein here, your jugular is invisible. What's the sentence? Your jugular is invisible. Yeah, jugular. Okay. Jug. You. Wait, it's an A-R. It is A-R, good. Jug, you, lure, uh huh, is in biz -e All right, let's see. Capital Jug, you, lure. Okay, this is hard to hear. It's Jug, you, lure. So, oh. what don't you need? Exactly. Okay, so how would you spell jugular? Can you write it again right there? Mm -hmm. Your jugular. Jug. Jug. You. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And there's that A-R after the L is invisible. You're right. Why did you pick I-B-L-E? Because it's not a word. Yeah, invis is not a word. Good. And period. Nice. That looks pretty good. All right. So let's go on to our... New thing, which is, last time you did mit, like when I transmit a signal, oh, yeah. right? Okay, which means to send it, right? This means the same thing. It's just that this can be mit or miss. Miss. Either one. So we're going to do the miss part today. To we, send. Same thing, right? Transmit is to send missile. something. A missile gets sent, right? Like North Korea. They wanted missiles. That is exactly correct. Well, they were testing their missiles, right? So they were seeing how far they could launch them, how far they could send them. It almost hit us. Um, well, it was it was quite far away from the continental United States, but not so far away from Alaska. Okay, so miss. Do you want to do trace copy cover on the board or on paper? Uh, board. And you want to do the little board or the big board? Little board. Okay. All right, so miss missile to send. Alright, so let's get this guy out of the way. Alright, so we've got miss 
missile to send, miss, missile to send, and miss, missile to send. And it's got something before it or after it, right? This is not miss like the word, yes. right? It's the root. Okay, so go ahead. Mit, miss, missile, miss, send. Oh, sorry. You said miss. I know. Mit. Miss. Out loud though. Miss. Miss. Missile to send. Mm -hmm. Miss. Missile to send. Mm -hmm. And. Miss. Missile to send. Nice. Okay, so. Trace copy. Miss okay. missile to send. Do I have Go to for say it. it. Yeah, still say it so it gets in your brain. Yep. Okay. Miss missile to send. Miss missile to send. Mm -hmm. Miss missile to send. Beautiful. Okay, trace copy. Here comes cover it up. How do you do to send? Miss. Miss, yep, so miss. 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 Missile to send. Okay, and two more times. <laughs> miss. Missile to send. Nice, and one more time. Miss. Missile to send. All right, eyes closed. Here we go. Yes. See if you can do all three of them without opening. Yes. All right, go for it. Miss. Missile to send. Miss missile to send. Miss to missile to send. Ooh, I'm gonna have a hard time picking my favorite. Those are all pretty gosh darn good. I don't know. <laughs> they all look good, don't they? Yeah. That's kind of amazing. I think. I think. Especially since you didn't have your eyes open. That was great. Alright, so miss is to send, but we have to still remember mit yeah. still means to send, right? Okay. Oh, we so got to play that game. We are going to, yeah, that game that I had made last time. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so miss, oh, thanks. Okay, so miss missile to send. This miss. This miss. Yep, and if I dismissed you, you all go. Okay. You all go apart. You get sent apart. Yeah, what's this? Missile. There's, well, that one's obvious. To send. To send. Okay. We miss. Mm -hmm. Mission. Right. And this S is for the shun, and this S is for the miss. The miss. Right. So if you're on a mission, what did somebody do? Badly. No, not badly. They... Oh, send. The, yeah, the act of sending you out. Go on a mission. Good. Missive. Mm-hmm. A mission. Yeah, that's the stuff that what? The act of what? Act of miss. Miss means send. to send. And then this is X. You just can't see the X in this word. The oh. act of sending out. It's the stuff that comes out of the end of your L. car. Right? Yeah. The exhaust. The emission. Good. Omission. Mm-hmm. Admission. Yeah, like, do you have to pay... Do people have to pay an admission price to go to your game? No. Okay, I didn't think so. Why? What about to go to your brother's game? No. They don't have to pay. They just walk in. Yeah. Okay, because this allows you to be sent in. Just like if you go to the movies, you have to buy an admission ticket. Yeah. Okay. The missile. This. This missile. Yeah. Remission. Commission. Mm hmm This missive. Nice. The admission price to the movies just keeps increasing. True. It gets more and more expensive. Our dismissal time is much earlier on Fridays than other days of the week. Mm-hmm. Car sales men work on commission instead of salary. Right. So do you know what commission is? I think it's like to keep the salary up. No, it's like um, the more expensive the item is you sell, the more money you make. So let's say you're a car salesman. Would you want to sell somebody a clunky $2,000 car or a $40,000 car? To forty, yeah, because you might get like five hundred dollars commission for this car and like twenty bucks for this one, 
right? So if you work on commission, the more you sell, the more money you get. Let's play. Let's play. All right, we're playing to lose. To win. We're going to play to win. Are you sure? Okay. Lately, I was be being good. I'm two and now. Yeah. For winning right now, so you have to catch up. I know. I have to get my act together. Red, okay. white, and blue. I'm just happy that I that I didn't lose a tic tac toe. <laughs> Lose a cat. That would be like Oops. unbelievable. Yeah. If I won again. Oh lord, that's a lot of pressure you're putting on me. Okay. And I dropped one of my guys. My guy's not ready. Okay. All right, we're playing to win? Yes. I don't know. Okay, you sure you want to play to win? Yep. Okay. Oops. Yep. This is fun. Okay. Okay. All right, I got to get my game on. Here we go. Omni's on. To win. All right. Okay. Okay, two. Omen. One. Omission. Three. The missile. Well, dis. Dismissal. Three. Dismissal. <laughs> Three. Dismiss. One. Omission. Six. Committee. Three again. Uh, I think the three is going to be out. Commitment. I know. Pretty soon. Oh. Five. Transmit. Five. Transmitter. One. Emit. Three. Remit. Yeah, and that was a nice one. <laughs> <laughs> Two. Submitted. <laughs> Three. A oh, whole. Look at that. Commitment. Four. I need a four. I know. Five. Five. Mission. One. Subcommittee. Five. Oh my god. Commission. Three. Aww. <laughs> We're in love with that number this game. <laughs> oh my Three. goodness! Three, Six. finally. Okay. Um, intermittent. Yes. <laughs> and you just won. Oh, you almost got five in a row. Nice. Oh, uh, I do. Almost, right? Look at one, two, three, four. If you would have moved one of those guys there, it would have been five in a row. Nice. All right. Let's see. We got perfect timing. You are leaving in. Less than 20 minutes. We got a spell. And we have to read your new book today, too. And practice your spelling words. Oh, boy. I know. Both I'm excited. Okay. What are we doing? Are we writing on the board or on uh, paper? Uh, board. Board. The big board? Yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. Let's try. All right. So, you're, yeah. So, you're not going to turn around so that they can't. You. Okay, here we go. First one is let's try dismiss. D I S M I S. Beautiful. Give yourself a star. Next one is remiss. Remiss. All E M I S S. Beautiful. Miss. Shun. M I S S I O N. How come you picked S I O N instead of T I O N? Because it has two S's. Yeah, Saturday Night Live. Good. Okay, how about um, E Miss Shun? E Miss Shun. E Miss Shun. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Okay. Add, you can go to the top, yeah, if you like. Add mission. Add mission. Uh huh. And the last one is how about dismissive? 
this Dismiss if. Nice. All right. Erase. Let's do a sentence. I need one. Oh, you need an eraser? Oh, that's because yeah. I stole it from you. Okay. Hey, yeah. Okay. Let's see if you can get this whole sentence. All right. Okay, here's your sentence. Dismiss the class at 3 o'clock. To miss the class at 3 o'clock. Right, except for it's dismiss the class at 3 o'clock. Oh, wait. Dismiss. Wait, no, dismiss the class at 3 o'clock. Perfect. I see what you did. You crossed off the small d and made a big d. Yep, perfect. Good. All right, you can erase. And let's start our new book here, which is Franklin Roosevelt. Franklin Delano Roosevelt. Okay. It actually has Teddy Roosevelt. I know. Well, so we've read... What did we just finish? Chief Sitting Bull. But didn't we read another one of these, too? Yeah. I think it was Jackie Robinson. Oh, right. And I saw me and my, me and Babe Ruth. Oh, those are, that was from a different series. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Without fuss. Okay. Do you know anything about Franklin Roosevelt? He was a president. He was. And... and he his uncle is Teddy Roosevelt. Yeah, his, the person he married, her uncle, so it's kind of his uncle too, yes. And he had polio, which meant it was a disease that he got, and once he got it, he was never able to walk again. Yeah. So when he's a kid, though, he's he's just, he's not like that at all. He got it as an adult, which is unusual, because people usually got it when they were a kid. Okay. So, okay, so without fuss. Are you starting or am I? You will. Good morning, Master Roosevelt, because they didn't, because he's super rich. rich. Yeah. The gardener tipped his hat to Franklin. You surely do ride well for a seven-year-old. Franklin just grinned and kicked his pony to a faster trot. His big black dog, Monk, barked with joy and romped alongside. Together, they paraded across the front lawn of Springwood, the Roosevelt's estate in Hyde Park, New York. Franklin was glad to be out of, for the hour of play after a long morning of lessons with his tutor. Ooh. So he's so rich that he doesn't go to school. He only gets homeschooled and has private I... tutors. Can you imagine? One tutor comes, they tutor you, they leave. The next tutor comes, they tutor you, they leave. You have no friends to play with. So this is almost like his recess. He's outside riding his, his pony. When the last tutor leaves, he can play where he wants. Right, but by that time, it's probably dinner time and everything else. At the edge of their lawn, the broad Hudson River glinted in the afternoon sun. Whoa. I know. Look at that. Franklin slid off Debbie's back and left the pony grazing on the new spring grasses. While he walked down to the water, he checked the knots holding their boats to the dock. A steamboat paddled up the river, belching smoke, skiffs and sloops. A, a catch and schooner hauled at their sails, steering wide to give the big boat extra space. Franklin leaned over to drag his fingers through the water and grinned. The hunting was still too cold for swimming. But the breeze was perfect for sailing. His father would be home for tea soon, he thought. Franklin jumped to his feet, wondering what his popsy, popsy, yeah, popsy, good, had planned for them for the afternoon. He glanced up the long sloping river bank to the huge old farmhouse at the top of the ridge. The sun reflected in its windows, hiding the bustle of maids and cooks. 
the nanny and the tutor inside. He squinted. His mother was standing silent and still on the front porch. He loved how she looked in her fine dresses. Right, so he is like really loaded, right? Yeah. And big house cooks, nannies, tutors, maids. So he has a servant. He, he has lots of them. And he has a gardener. Lucky. <laughs> Franklin waved and she gestured calmly for him to come in. When he ran up onto the porch, she said simply, I have news. He followed his mother into her study, being careful not to step on the edges of her long skirt. Monk followed too, quiet now. Mother sat down at her desk and folded her hands in her lap. Franklin sat on a satin chair nearby. What is it, mother? he asked when he couldn't stand to wait any longer. Archibald Rogers has died, dear. Now, Archibald is his best friend, so you can imagine what he feels like, right? Archibald is dead? When? Franklin pictured his best friend and blinked hard to hold back tears. But, Mother, we play together every week. What happened to Archibald? Tell me. Is that the dog? This is his best friend, a kid. Oh, why? Well, I... Now Franklin, Franklin, Franklin froze at the tone in her voice. Mother didn't like it when he made a fuss. He took a shuddering breath and stared up at the portrait of his ancestor, Isaac Roosevelt. The painting had hung in Franklin's home as long as he could remember. Isaac Roosevelt, 1726 to 1794. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> that was awesome. Franklin recited the portrait's label to himself from memory. New York's first state senator. It helped him to quiet down. So did Isaac's stern, proud gaze. Archibald died of... Diphtheria. He close. Son. Diphtheria. Yep. Son, Franklin winced at his mother's words. That was one of the awful illnesses that his parents worried about. Scarlet fever, polio, me measles, me measles, mm -hmm. appendixes. Close. Appendicitis. Uh huh. Pneumonia. It looks like it. Pneumonia. And diphtheria. There were many more. This is most unfortunate indeed. Mrs. Roosevelt said Franklin slid from his chair and went to stand by her. One would think, she said, that by 1889 they would have found a cure. Franklin wiped his eyes and his mother went on. Young Archibald was one of a few suitable playmates for you in Hyde Park. So he lived in New York. He, he lives not too far from here, right by Poughkeepsie, oh, right? Yeah. But because he's so rich, she's like, oh, you can't play with him. He doesn't have enough money. But this kid he really liked, and his family also had a lot of money. So his mother was like, he's a suitable playmate. You can play with him. So now she's like, what are we going to do? There are no suitable playmates for you. No. My yeah. mom wouldn't kill. <laughs> well, exactly. Because my mom just says, oh, this is your new friend. Right. Okay. I, exactly. Let me see your parents. Or if his parents are mean, I'm not being, you cannot play with him. Yeah, exactly. With mom. With whom? With whom will I play, mother? Archibald had a brother, didn't he? He would be suitable. And our guests at dinner parties are always glad to speak with him, you, Franklin. And there are always the relatives. Franklin wanted a hug. He threw his arms around Monk and squeezed, then leaned his cheeks against the dog's shaggy fur to feel the animal's warmth. Monk's tail thumped against the elegant silk carpet. Mrs. Roosevelt looked sharply at the big dog, but said nothing. Franklin loosened his arms around the dog. It licked him as he stood up. Franklin cleared his throat and stared at the Bible on the shelf below the portrait. His name was in there. The big old book was written in Dutch. It had been passed down through the family for generations, and every birth and death and marriage was recorded there. 
he con he concentrated trying to picture his page and is and its spidery writing. Franklin Delano Roosevelt, born January thirtieth, eighteen eighty two. All of his famous family was in there. <coughs> bless you. <coughs> bless you. Bless Thank you. you. And all of the others who had died, Franklin thought of diseases, of diphtheria. He swallowed hard. Yeah, why is he doing that? Why is he like... Because he would actually get it from his ancestors. He, well, he's not going to get it from his ancestors, but he might be afraid of getting it, right? Actually, in the... When he was older, he got sick. He ended up getting polio, exactly. Come here, dear, Mrs. How did Roosevelt he get said. It? You know, we're not really sure. Um, he was totally exhausted. He had visited a Boy Scout camp, and so there were lots of kids there, and maybe one of them had it, and he caught it from them. We're not really sure, because it was a long time ago, so we don't really know like how how he got it. We know how Donald Trump is. <laughs> Okay, so... You may help with me with my stamp collection. Franklin leaned over her shoulder and looked at the stamps spread across her desk. They seemed to melt together. In the tears that filled in his eyes, he sniffed but quietly. Look at this once. Franklin, Miss Roosevelt said, It is from Great Britain. And that is a picture of the English Queen, Victoria. Oh, I thought it was uh, Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, not yet, because this is too early, but yeah. Okay. She's still alive. Different Queen, yes. Okay. Wait, there's so many Elizabeths? There's a lot of Elizabeths, yes. So, the first Elizabeth was right after Victoria. Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure. She has ruled that country and dozens of others in her commonwealth for 52 years now. Well, the other one is like 100. That's amazing. Franklin stared at the woman on the stamp. It was interesting to think that someone had held power for so long. Would you like to hold the stamp? Franklin could not believe it when Mother handed him the treasels. She turned on the new electric light and let him look through her hand lens and at the woman who ruled countries. Then Mrs. Roosevelt gave him a little folded mounting patch and let him lick one side and glue it to the back of the stamp. Franklin looked at her. She nodded and then pointed to the sock. Well, the st stamp fit, fit into her huge album. Right, so this is her way of being nice to him. She doesn't give him a hug. She doesn't cry with him. She just says, now, Franklin, like, that's enough of that. And then lets him hold a stamp in her stamp. Why a stamp? Well, because it was very important to her and very precious, and he knew that, so he was kind of surprised, and it kind of took his mind off of things. Actually, I have a field trip tomorrow at the Baskerville House yeah. for the American Revolution. <laughs> Except Mrs. Uh, Spare and Mrs. Uh, Sheridan said to us, oh, you're going on the studies for 2018 next year. I'm like, why we're going. The seventh grade is in seventh grade. Yeah. And I have a lot of friends in seventh grade. We're going on the same bus. Huh. That's interesting. All yeah. right. Franklin wanted to shout for joy. He had never been allowed to touch his hair stamp collection before. He tried to keep his hand from trembling as he licked the other side of the patch and tried to center the stamp in the square mother had shown him. Franklin held his breath and felt the glue stick to the paper. It was perfect. Mother gave his shoulder a warm pat. Pardon me, they looked up. Franklin's new governess stood in the doorway, her ruffled apron sparkling white against her long navy dress. Master Roosevelt, the tutor is ready for your German lesson. Not now, Franklin almost groaned aloud, but caught himself in time. Franklin, dear, mother said, 
You may spend time with your popsy this afternoon at four o'clock. He is expecting to sail with you. Now kiss me and go on. She tilted her head to offer her cheek. Like not a kiss on the lips, just like a kiss me there. With a last glance at the stamp album, Franklin kissed his mother and followed his governess out. Let's see. All right.